فعاش القلب إخلاصا وصرت تحومك الطير تحلق في ثقافات وتنهل من روبا الخير Nowadays I don't know what platform you might be using here, but I do know that there is something called WhatsApp. I'm sure you know what it is, isn't it? People can sit on WhatsApp for five hours without even noticing that they've sat on it. I promise you. They can sit on the internet and on their phones for about 10 hours without even noticing that they've sat on the phone. And if they could eat, they would eat through the phone as well. Really. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgive us. We waste time. We waste time. I was looking at my contact list last night and I've got approximately three and a half thousand contacts on my phone. And I was thinking to myself, I had about 753 WhatsApp messages in the evening. And I'm thinking if I have to answer all these messages, I will be here for one week. And by that time, I will already be having more. So all I have to do is select a few, try and see. Oh, by the way, first scroll down and see if wifey has messaged. Mashallah. Yeah, you better do that because otherwise there's a problem. There'll be warfare, you know. <laughs> so you first scroll down and see if you know a few people, you know, some VIPs in your life, they need to be answered to immediately and you answer them. And then if there's numbers that you don't really know, or sometimes people who are just asking you, you know what really irritates me? And I'm going to say this aloud. Okay. When someone says, Assalamu Alaikum. Okay. I said, Wa Alaikum Assalam. There's no verse of the Quran and no hadith which says I need to type it out. Do you know that? You type, you send me a salam alaikum. I said, wa alaikum as salam. But so I said it. I, who said I need to type it out? I really. So now the person says, if I do type it out, wa alaikum as salam. They say, now I am busy doing so many things. And here I have a salam alaikum. And I think, oh, mashallah, you know, beautiful brother, uh, you know, a genuine sister, for example, wa alaikum as salam. Maybe they want something important. How are you? I'm fine. How's your children? Oh, they're okay. How's everyone? That's okay. How's the weather? Come on, get to the point, please. What do you want? It's not like I'm being funny, but come on, these are important. If there was something wrong, I would put it on Facebook to say, guys, I'm feeling sick, make dua for me. Subhanallah. The whole world would know, oh, sick. Subhanallah. Remember the last time I had a motor vehicle accident and the whole world knew about it? Do you remember? And shukran for your duas, by the way. You can see I'm fit. Mashallah. I'm here in front of you, isn't it? Alhamdulillah, shukran, shukran. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us genuinely feel for one another. Don't wait for someone to advertise that they are unwell. Just make a dua for the entire ummah. And if there are specific names, say them. Don't worry, draw a list of names, you know, and keep on saying, Oh Allah, help, bless this person, bless that person. Oh Allah, help them in whatever they're going through. May Allah help every single one of you in whatever you need His help in. And that's your entire life. I mean.